Thank you for joining us, Raghav. Yeah, it's great to be here. Um, so before we start talking about the device, can you tell me a little bit about this honor that you just received? Yeah, so um, I was very fortunate to receive the Prudential Spirit of Community Awards being named the National Honoree. And so in the U.S., that award is given to youth from middle school to high school who um, do volunteering and they are recognized through this award. And so there's originally two state honorees. So there's one in the middle school level mm -hmm. and one in the high school level. And so they are selected from each state. And then there are 10 national honorees selected. And there are five middle school uh, level honorees and, and uh, five high school level honorees. Wonderful. And tell me a little bit about yourself and your uh, background. Yeah, so I'm in eighth grade. And I'm from San Jose, California. And um, I really, uh, I have a bunch of hobbies. They're kind of random, but I kind of like soccer and music. And also just working on electronic projects just in my free time. Great. So let's talk about the device. Tell me a little more about it and how it works. Yeah, so, um, so out of the various physical disabilities, a visual impairment can impact one uh, by a lot. And so by removing one of the senses, they lose a lot of information about their environment and navigation becomes really, becomes really hard for them. So their primary mobility aid is the white cane. Mm -hmm. And so if you've ever seen a visually impaired person, you probably have seen them with a cane. And that devices have been there for almost a couple of centuries now in different forms such as rods and sticks and staffs. And so the whole underlying idea has been to use a sort of cane to feel around their environment mm -hmm. and uh, get information about their environment to make decisions of how to avoid obstacles. However, the, the device, the white cane, can only detect obstacles at, at its reach and obstacles that are on the ground. And But visually impaired people face a lot of obstacles in multiple other areas, mm -hmm. and this can lead to them having a lot of collisions and navigation becomes really inefficient for them. So I thought maybe since the visual, since the white can has been like been the same basically for almost so many centuries, I thought maybe I could give it a, techno, a technology update, sure. so it could then become more useful for them and could allow them to navigate much safer and more efficiently. Great. Um, so, Raghav, can we take a look at this device? I want our viewers out there yeah. to see how it looks. Yeah. So this is um, the device, mm -hmm. and so uh, it it has two uh, range finders that detect obstacles three meters away. Okay. And so these uh, work on two different principles. This one works kind of like a bat, uh -huh. and this one works using infrared uh, sensors. Watch the remaining show on ITV Gold. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable Channel 1539. ITV Gold is America's first full-time television channel that caters to the South Asian community. Your favorite dramas with English subtitles. Watch movies, back-to-back -back songs, award-winning local news coverage, and much, much more. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable, Channel 1539, part of the 8-channel combo pack for $39.95. And our East Coast viewers can also subscribe to ITV on RCN, Channel 476, and Cablevision on Channel 1168.